Hey everyone, Magic Lover recording a little legacy one on one action in the practice room. Uh, I'm playing my Genesis Wave deck. And. Wow, that's for poker, right? How do I ignore trips? Um, nah, we'll take it. In the worst case scenario, I'll bash with a 5 5 Nest Invader. Uh oh. Looks like meat hooks. Um, anything that leads off of an ancient ziggurat usually to me means slivers. Which is a tough matchup for me. Because I don't have removal to take like the uh, flying sliver out. So I'm going to hope that I just um, yeah. I hope that I ramp out quick enough. So let's do this. Let's do this. And let's do this. Sliver is not known for playing counter spells, which is good for me. This is going to be useless, as is this. Yeah. So I'm going to take some beats. Surprised he didn't swing there, to be honest. Um, hmm. Yeah, I mean I'm gonna gonna definitely crack. And if he wants to give up one of his uh, muscle slivers, he's welcome to. So I might be winning the race now, but obviously I'm not when this gets active and he dumps something in there. But the flying one is the one I fear, because I can chump out a couple until I get a hold of a Genesis wave, which I'll be waving for probably, what, like 10 now? Ugh. can't believe they reprinted Muscle Sliver. Yeah. Do I block one here just so I avoid an alpha strike? Four. No. Puts me to 11. If he drops the flying one, I'm screwed anyway. Right. So. Let's get some blockers down. Are we reading that going what the H? Um, man, I'm gonna do this just for value right now. I mean, doesn't matter. And I'm not recurring anything, he's not gonna counter anything. So, do I attack? Yeah, I think I do. So I'm going to have to do some chump in here. Hopefully he does not. I mean, if he had the blue one, he would have put it down and end a turn. He's going to two there. I mean, he can still put it down. But why wouldn't he have? Three. Oh, that is no we bueno. Ugh. Snyder's going to win the race. Not that it was much of a race with slivers to begin with, but this one's going to hurt. So, one, two, three, four. He can put down another lord. So I'd have to block it with one, two, three, four, five. Untap. Yeah, okay. Let's, um. I'm going to risk the blow out here. So what I'm thinking is I force him to drop whatever he's got. If it's a lord, I'm going to take 10. And it's I either I'm going to draw a Genesis Wave or not. 
this doesn't really change it, but with this I've got enough. One, two, three, six, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen if I sack. So wave for fourteen. Yeah. Let's see if he drops a lord here. Yep. Okay, so I'm gonna take ten, go to one, which doesn't change the clock. And sadly, I'm okay with the three for one. Boo. So that's not going to work. And I'm dead. He's gonna take this one, fine. Yeah. How close were we? Nope. Wasn't gonna happen. Okay. Uh let's see. That's gonna be important. Um That's gonna be important. Not as important as it. And nope. I'll run with it. Hmm. Got everything but the wave. And a one drop. I'll keep it. So I'm gonna fetch out a Dryad Arbor here. So I can put down the Nesty next turn. Cavender Souls, making creature aggro viable again. And... Let's get some... Hey, you know what? I'm going to go Fist here. Does the same thing. Creates two critters. But at least if he boarded in any sort of spot removal, I don't have to worry about it being used now, because he's tapped out. Or can't generate swords to plowshare mana. And we will. Uh, yeah. We're going to rotate here. To get the cradle, uh, creature count is going to be important. And hopefully we can find the namesake of the deck. We can find a Genesis Wave sometime soon, because I probably only have three turns left. I will aggressively chump, especially now that I have this. So if he swings, I'll fight him. Okay. That's handy. Uh, I'm pretty much just going to try to build up the board as, as much as I can so that I can take out as many of his lords if he tries to push through. Usually I see that in Dredge, but here it is. Muscle Sliver. Come on, send him in. Ugh. Everything's a lord. Mm. Why not go for Gusto? Ugh. Kill me here, kid. Let's get the crop rotation.
got 16 points to distribute. I can take out a couple of the lords, but it's getting less and less every time. Jesus. Wish I could target this. Ugh. So you go for it? him there and 18 at me interesting it's funny too I've got enough spawn to well <clears throat> so obviously I can't take the 18 so do I throw enough in front of him Yeah, I think I'm going to... Throw that in front of him. And... Throw that in front of him. Oh! Oh boy! Well now. Well now. Um. Okay. This is gonna be interesting. Because I have to go for it. So, I'm not even gonna bother doing the math. Because it's an alpha swing. So we'll just give this a little whirl. <laughs> Here's a draw for you. You want the fight? Give it a whirl. <laughs> uh, let's see. Is there anything I can do to target? Well, I guess I'll be saving my fist for... Hmm. Okay. not incredibly helpful. How come I can't draw a Genesis wave? Two games, I haven't seen one yet. About, what, 20-ish cards deep into my deck for this? That's annoying. Okay. I haven't really seen this in sliver builds. So I need I need to pull something soon. I mean this is good in that ooh, that's gonna be helpful. Okay. So let's try to Um do I go for that this no, okay. Okay. 
So this is handy in that I can swords one of his lords and then block this. What's he going to cast? Of course. Mm -hmm. Yeah, great. get to kill it. Damn. I think I kind of have to go for this just to only take two here. Because Meat Hooks is all about the clock. I mean... Come on. What am I gonna do? Swing for three and have him die? Yeah. I got, what, one more turn? It's gonna drop a lord, swing with the vault. I'm gonna eat it, go down to a couple, and hopefully draw a. Yeah. Uh, hopefully draw a Genesis wave for the first time in three games. Not that I'm upset with my deck for not coughing one up, but it would be nice. Just saying. Ah, uh, you failed. And this should be lethal. Because my deck coughed up. This. Yeah. That sucks. Oh well. Them's the brakes. <laughs>